This is what happened, but you aren't here, so you missed it. It's Angry Bird Pupsin. He says, hey guys, how are you going to celebrate David Bowie's birthday today? He's 66. Kristen's going to stay in her nest all day. No. <laughs> I wish. Yeah, I know. I wish too, but somebody's got to go out and buy things. Otherwise, there'll be nothing to eat. Right, puppy? Yeah. Ah! Miss, miss, how will you be celebrating David Bowie's birthday? Ah! <laughs> awesome! I know. We just watched a whole bunch of David Bowie da, 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 David Bowie videos. It's good stuff. You should check it out. In fact, Mark reported to me this morning that he's coming out with a new album. I don't know if it's out today, actually, or not, but we will be looking for it. All right, guys. So we're just picking up Hanley's package. Thank Thank you. Go. <laughs> All right. I can't do it. And I was going into the post office, and Kristen told me those leggings look slutty. So I was trying to pull down my sweater and be really obvious about it, and I almost walked into this guy who was coming out. <sighs> oh, mom. So yeah, that's what happens when you try and be funny. You get caught. Yeah. I wish you had been filming it. It would have been hilarious. Well, you couldn't really see because that. I know, but then when I got on the other side of the pole, I looked over and I, I saw went, that. Yeah. Wow, what is it, Maddie? Ah! Come on, use all your strength. I did. Ooh. When you opened that, the lighting changed what? on the camera and it looked like, oh. Oh my gosh, Hanley, thank you. Oh, that is That's so awesome. cool. Ah! <laughs> oh, that is so cool. That's so nice. I'm not wow. worthy. Wow, you are not worthy. That is really cool, thank you. <laughs> Yay! Thank you so much. We're putting this right at the front of the show. <laughs> ah! You should get that from Riddell, but he doesn't wear clothes. He's wearing that. This is really nice. I would get this if it came in flash this size. He likes that. Cat boots. Ah, Rolling Stone. What, only the little dogs like the British bands? That's right. BS. <laughs> All right. You must demonstrate the shirt. Like I weird <laughs> it make it makes a really weird but like the girl in the bachelor last night who was dancing like Kristen Wig must have no. had one of those on. Like her dress must have been the made Kristen this. Wig reference. She just she kinda looked like a drunky Kristen Wig. <laughs> you say so. From Mars. Why is it that I am on shelf here, Maddie? <laughs> Thank you for standing me upright. <laughs> well, put my scarf on. That's not how he talks. You got I, the grammar all wrong. How is it? I don't know. I need not <laughs> to go back to shelf where I was. I give up. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Whoop, cat fisticuffs, go for it. What's going on over here, squirrels? Hi. Hi! Oh, look who's all full of energy today. Because he's back on the feast. Alright, so that won't be long though because... It's like boy fight from the rest of the development. <laughs> Alright, so we got... I don't know. I don't think we really got that much stuff today. It just seems like a lot because we got like a lot of dog and cat food. So I spent a long time in yeah, the pet store. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> just talking to her. All right, so I ended up, after reading like a thousand different labels and everything, getting the uh, Wilderness Blue Buffalo, uh, the chicken one, with the natural evolutionary diet. The reason why I liked it a lot was because it had cranberry in it. And cranberry is really good for the urinary tracts. And while I'm not going to give it to Gaston right now, if he does perhaps get into the food, it will be okay for I him. just ate a suspicious piece of tuna. Is that why it smells bad? <sighs> no, it smells bad because it's tuna. Hope I don't get sick. I hope I don't die right now. <laughs> okay, so on that note, and I decided I wanted to try this for the dogs. Organics, grain-free adult dog food. Chicken, peas, and flaxseed. So um, that wasn't cheap either. That was like $10 for that bag. But I wanted to mix it in with the Rachel Ray and see if, you know, 
I want to do what's right for my pets. I got them You're a lot of. Worth it. Yeah, I got a lot of different canned foods too. This Simply Nourish, I think, is new because it was like on the end cap. This was like a dollar for this size can, and I also got the um, canned food that goes along with the Wilderness one in chicken. So, see how that works out. And for the dogs, I got the Simply Nourish uh, chicken and rice stew, and I think I also got um, chicken and pasta or something like that. And I got um, the two of the cans that go along with the organics uh, dry. So I'm just going to give those a try. Toilet paper! Uh, you, you guys know I love the toilet paper that's like sandpaper, so I got a big old Scott 1000 roller. Maddie got some mixed fruit to take with her because you can't always have fresh. She just said that. I'm just repeating it. You gonna show off your sweaters, David Bowie? Okay. I am so jelly about that shirt today. I love it. It's so hot. These were on the cheap, and I really like light sweaters because I get really hot. Yeah. For Valentine's Day. Oh, I was just gonna wear it for regular. Oh yeah, but I mean, <laughs> I'm I'm sure maybe that's why they had. No, I guess not if it was marked down. That might have been from the fall and they had it marked down. Yeah. This is so California. That would have even been better if it was like, I love New York. Well, it's not. So write in an NY on the heart. <laughs> I, I don't want to write on my clothes. I'll get the Sharpie out. Let's no. do it right now. No. All right. So we got, well, look at how Kristen left her garbage here. Pineapple, because today's fruit of the day and 50 top healthiest food of the day is? Pineapple. Correct. Express. Correct. You get a dollar. I don't have one handy right now, but. All right. Uh, wait, what'd you say? You know Billy I can hear. <laughs> Pineapple Express? Give me that dollar back. All right. Haribo, Gold Bears. I didn't even know this was on sale. I got it for Maddie to take back to school with her, and it was a dollar off, and I was like, what? So yeah, winning. She got her favorite uh, reporter <laughs> um, protein bars endorsed by reporters, zone bars. If you're a reporter, you better be eating these because that's what's required. Guardian Crispy Tenders, they were still on sale. Uh, we got a whole buttload of cheese here, <laughs> as Mark would say. Big five pound bag of grated mozzarella. Some feta cheese for me, some feta cheese for Maddie, some um, Olive Garden cheese for Maddie to bring back with her. Some bananas, because you know what? Smoothies just aren't the same without the banana in there. It makes it so creamy. And it doesn't really add that much uh, badness to it, or at all. We had to get these. Quirkies. Maddie's reasoning, because one of the owls was winking. <laughs> Look what she got as a pre-birthday present. No, I thought that was for my birthday. That's not the only thing you're getting on your birthday. But it's like part of it. All right, it's for her birthday, but we picked it out before her birthday, so it was like a pre-birthday. But she can't have it. Fred Astaire! The Fred Astaire collection. Gay Divorcee, Swing Time, Shall We Dance, and Top Hat. It's Fred and Ginger. Fred and Ginger? Does, he, does this involve him getting a head transplant at any time during the movies? Don't be like that. <laughs> All right, it's a little private joke, which is not that private between the two of us and us. So we got um, Diet 7 Up and Diet Sierra Mist because we're having Continentals. If you guys remember what that is, it's Diet Sierra Mist and strawberries. In? A shot glass. No, <laughs> in a champagne glass, in a stemless wine glass. <gasps> Yay, I got it. All right, so here's the food up close for the dogs. In case he didn't see it before. Oh, Gaston's jealous. He said, bling, 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 bling. <laughs> All right, I got some milk for my coffee. My phone is ringing. Someone please get my phone. And soap. And frozen blueberries for smoothies, taco chips, and potatoes. All right, hopefully that was no biggie. It was just the school nurse saying that there was a little fisticuffs at school. A little innocent, uh... I, I'm hoping. I'll interview Sean when he gets home and make sure that everything is okay, but it, I'm not really concerned at this point, so. Let's continue. 
I got my broccoli and I'm trying this for the first time, the Healthy Choice Greek Frozen Yogurt. I've seen this at ShopRite, but not in the big box like this, like they have a smaller uh, version of this, but I got this at Sam's Club. Only 100 calories per little Dixie cup in there. So I'm interested to try that and I'm going to be trying it tonight uh, with the recipe that I'm making. So make sure you check it out. And lettuce and tomatoes because we eat lots of veggies. Right? Yes. Who are you texting? <laughs> okay. All right. What does Billy Eichner have to say? Did Al Roker wipe his pants? I don't know. Change his pants? I don't know. Did that happen recently? I don't know. Thank you. You're in font of no information. Sorry. Oh, hello, sir. It would appear that it's the best time of the day. Yes. I love that. Welcome home. Thank you. <sighs> So it's that time again. It's 8 o'clock. Time to cook dinner. And tonight we're having gluten free pizzas. One pepperoni, one meatball. I left the door cracked because both kittles are down there. Guess what? Gigi can fit through the cat door now. But I want to make it easier for So Maddie brought up some three cheese. Hmm. Looks interesting. We got a whole new bag of mozzarella. And tonight is the pineapple, broiled pine... Honey, guess what we're having for the recipe of the day? We're having broiled pineapple with Greek yogurt ice cream on the top. I know, right? Sounds pretty amazed. Amazing, doesn't it? Hi! All of the pets loved their food tonight. Friggin' Verdell wolfed it down like a mother freaka. <laughs> And so did you. There was not a lick of food to be left. And the cats buried their faces in the food bowls and wouldn't come up for air even. Usually they switch plates. Hi, how was your food tonight? Good. How was the food tonight, sir? He says he's not talking. <laughs> it was good stuff. What are you doing? It's <laughs> down there. All right. Tell him to come up. Tell him. GG, come up. Come on. Come on, G. He says, eh. Gigi. You're making me nervous. He's staring at me. Well, he says, go away. You're making him nervous. It's like trying to pee with other people in the bathroom. <laughs> Sorry, but it's true. Hi. Hi. There he goes. See, he was just pee shy. That's all. Hi. It's dinner time. It's pizza night. Are you ready to party? Only two tonight. Yeah, only two. Mom's I'm gonna start talking. <laughs> Remember? Yeah. I'm gonna what? I told you we only needed a medium. A medium what? It's from out in the middle. Oh. Got a little modified Greek salad here because the Greek salad last night sucked. Oh, it suck. <laughs> it wasn't great. Anyhow, um, Kristen, why don't you tell. What are you doing? I don't know. You'll suck! <laughs> Alright, Kristen, why don't you tell everybody how good the. Um, Good. The date nut bars are. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, no, good. <laughs> Kristen gave up her flavored cereal and went to the plain checks and is eating them with these um, date nut bars because it's so good, right? Yep. Yeah, baby. Make the date nut bars. You won't be sorry. How's the pizza tonight? Good. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you for your opinion. Where do you think you're going? Apparently nowhere. Alright, so we just filmed the uh, food of the day tutorial. So it was pineapple that was broiled with hun cow froyo on top. Yeah, so we're going to go uh, sing happy birthday to David Bowie. And uh, we'll catch you next time. Till then. Much love.